What's up guys and welcome back to Cart Bros and well I do have a cart to show y'all today but to this video I kind of a little bit of a fuckery. I finally was able to save what Christmas money and what money I was able to come up with to get me a nice little haul starting out 2020. Well I tried every way possible and my card would not let me pull the money off of my card for some freaking answer, but I was able to use it if I was doing a purchase. So I had to legally, so to speak, buy some products that I'm going to review for you guys. And I'm going ahead and just go ahead and announce it now. All the products that I got are either smoking related products and everything is completely 100% CBD. I have no THC in these products whatsoever. And a couple of things I just grabbed just because, well, I thought it'd be a nice start for 2020 for me and the guys to get going for this year and to just not have a regular cart review. But I am going to go ahead and start with the cart that I ended up picking up. This one is just CBD and it is strawberry flavored. Go ahead and check that out. I'm going to be doing a review of that. This video is just to show you guys what I got. Um, I'm going to be doing a review of each and every single thing um, in different videos. But this one is just going to be uh, show you what show you guys what my haul is. But I did get a cart, just CBD, strawberry, like I said, uh, non-GMO, vegan, THC free. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love the THC. There isn't THC without healthcare. Prove that. Alright. My next thing is a two-parter that I'm gonna go with, but I'm gonna get go ahead and show the best part for last. But I picked up three and a half grams of special sauce forbidden fruit. CBD flower. Try to show you guys through the bottom of this thing. Doesn't look too bad. Doesn't smell too bad for being CBD stuff. But honestly, just by looks and smell of it, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. But ah, <laughs> uh, picked up a new lighter finally went on the uh, train and bought me a clipper I've always been a big guy so I bought me my first clipper as everybody that's been watching the channel for quite some time I have I believe I've mentioned I used to be or when I started when I first started the channel I was a cigarette smoker well I have quit and with some stressful times, I've had the urge to pick my cigarettes back up, and I seen these, and I figured, what the hell. I ended up picking up a pack of hemp cigarettes. Uh, wild hemp. Made in the USA. Hemplets, as they call it. I've tried two so far, and I'm not, I'm not going to say any more further about it. Um, but they're not too bad. I forgot to mention the best part of before going to the hemp cigarettes. Um, the best part of the uh, CBD flower is I will be smoking it out of raw. The classic black raw rolling papers. Gotta roll with the best. So if this video ever reaches out to Josh, Josh, thanks for making the awesome product you do and fucking rock on dude I'm loving this I'm loving your product and I wish I had a strain 
of everything so I never have to go out and buy another roll of paper again in my life which to be completely honest I was when I was at the store getting the raw papers right next to the register actually literally right in front of the register was the challenge cone and I seen that I'm like damn challenge cone challenge accepted <laughs> If I ever had the opportunity to fill one of them things, I would sit down and smoke the whole damn thing with a couple people because I know it would probably take quite a bit to fill it. But anyway, it would be a hell of a goal. <laughs> but to move on, as I said, I did get the flower. I did pick up a couple pre-rolls. Uh, this one is Kuala. Kuala. CBD pre-roll joint. It is a hundred milligram mid mid monster uh, pre-roll, and it is also rolled in a raw cone. Uh, so I'm expecting good quality out of that, cause well, if it's put in a raw, it's got to be some good ass shit. <laughs> um, I did pick up another package of pre-rolls. Uh, these are premium full spectrum hemp flower uh, master blend uh, CBD pre rolls. Uh, they're rolled in the element cones, uh, two half gram joints uh, that I'm going to try out. Um, the next two things I'm going to split up into two different videos to make them their own thing. But as I said, each individual thing I, sh I have showed you, I'm going to do a review video of each and every single one going into 2020, end of 2019, so on and so forth. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the smaller bag. Yes, I picked up a $10 concentrate grab bag. Now, I don't know what's in this grab bag yet. Obviously, obviously you can tell I still have it sealed. But I picked up a $10 grab bag and I also picked up a $20 dry grab bag. And if for the ones that don't know what a dry grab bag is, it would basically be dry flour. It's not going to be any liquids, it's not going to be anything dripping, no oils, no nothing, that's why it's dry. But alright guys, this was my entire haul that I wish was the good stuff, but we got a nice variety of CBD products that we're going to give a shot going into 2020. Um, Hopefully my next haul that I do is going to be better um, Since I wasn't able to get my big haul how I wanted I, I knew everything I freaking was going to get knew exactly what I wanted my dude had it already I was just very bummed to tell him that I wasn't going to be able to come through and get it but He told me what he had that's what I was going to pick up so no harm no foul i hope not but i am hoping with the concentrate bag that there's probably a little kit to do my own because i was going to get some concentrate and do my own little uh my own cartridge but then yeah. so I don't know what I'm going to do first. I'm probably going to do one of the pre-rolls. Uh, do a pre-roll video. Give you know, give what I think of it. Smoke it halfway through, three quarters, finish the video. Then I'll probably finish it off and uh, while I do one of the bags. I don't know. I'll probably go eeny meeny, miny mo on which bag I should go. But that's where I'm at for right now guys so um, but yeah I'm probably gonna go with uh, probably not that one I'm probably gonna go with this one 
This will probably be the first one I do a review of. I'll smoke this, and by the time this is almost done, I'll be doing a bag. Sorry, guys. Take it easy. And Madman Joe is out.